everybody welcome to the stream here i come there we go hello welcome 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 to strange town sunday so i saw somebody ask in the chat um it's only for this week that i had to move it to sunday because i had a family thing yesterday <coughs> excuse me um hello everybody welcome welcome so today we're gonna be playing strange town of course and i gotta get the game loading because i was barely here in time so let me just do this real quick i forgot i also have to change over to my strange town game so give me a second to do that and i hope you guys are having a great weekend so far i don't even know what i was doing um uh, let me see strange town saturday there we are so actually i'm having another family thing today because my sister wasn't able to make it yesterday um, so she's coming today after I finish the stream. Okay, it's telling me that the file or folder is open in another program. I don't know what that means. Did I already start the game? I don't know. Well, I'm gonna have technical difficulties. I'm sorry, y'all. Um, try again, please. Okay, there we go. I got it now. Aw, oh, thank you so much, Kira1983, for the 17 months at Tier 1. So, we're not having any... I don't have any audio here. Oh, there it goes. And thank you so much, Vlada90, for the three months at Tier 1. Thank you guys so much. I really appreciate that. So, I got the game loading up here in the background. So, we'll be ready in just a second. So, I'm excited to get back to Strange Town. Let's see. Where are we today? So, we finished Rip Grunt, right? And we were on Barb and Margaret. So, I think we're going to finish Barb and Margaret's last day. Let me turn that down just a bit there. We're gonna finish. Yeah, that was loud. I'm sorry. <laughs> Thank you. This dress um, was a gift from my boyfriend for Christmas. And also this pretty necklace, which I've, I've got to fix here. Um, he also bought me this really pretty necklace to go with it. Uh, thank you so much. I stole your fruit for giving out five community gift subs. Thank you so much for giving gift subs to Fred M1978. Uh, Cotton 9009, Aiden Aiden Real, Lulu 5490, and Suburban Mother. Thank you so much I stole your fruit. Give me my fruit back. <laughs> and thank you so much the Orb of Wisdom for the 16 month Prime sub. I really appreciate that. And thank you for the 100 bits I stole your fruit. Thank you. I love mushroom patterns too. And this uh, dress, oh I didn't think about the green in it and the green screen. Oops. Um, this dress came from a little shop in my town called Stella Mays, and they sell the cutest dresses. If you ever come to Arkansas, you should go there. It's on the Sims Black Market. <laughs> what is? <laughs> oh, the fruit? <laughs> Thank you. Uh, good evening, guys. You've been sick all week with COVID? Oh, you caught up on all my streams. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I'm sorry that you've been sick. That sucks. I've been sick as well. Uh, thank you so much, Snowy Oreo, for the 13 months. And thank you so much for the raid, Spider in the Sim. Hello, raiders. <laughs> thank you so much. We're just getting started here, so it's a good time to join. And I have my coffee here. My coffee with my metal straw. Oh my gosh, that's so good. My boyfriend put uh, cinnamon and ginger in it. Ooh, it's really good. Oh, thank you so much, Mashy Sims, for giving out five gift subs as well. Thank you so much for giving subs to Shaney Brook, Moonwork, Little Lena, uh, Fish H, and Agents of Geekdom. Thank you so much. The coffee is good. It's very good. Good afternoon. Oh, yeah, I forgot it's afternoon and not morning. I think I was saying good morning earlier. I don't know. Maybe not. <laughs> I've been running around this morning trying to get stuff ready for my sister's visit after the stream. Aw, thank you so much for the 1,000 bits. I really appreciate that. I stole your fruit. It's supposed to snow here today as well, which makes me worried that my sister might not be able to come because she lives like an hour away. So it's supposed to, we're supposed to have a snowstorm today. I don't know. It's I can see outside it's not snowing, but it is very, very, very cold here. It's freezing i had to go to the store earlier oh my gosh i had to wear my big coat it is really cold thank you so much for the five months uh five month prime sub the new yorker guy thank you so much okay let me check my game y'all let's see where we're at here 
Okay, it's still in the loading. It's still loading, but we're getting there. Uh, hello to Germany. You've been buried in snow in Utah. Oh my gosh. Oh, did I get another raid too? Oh, no, I didn't. Thank you for the raid. <laughs> Radio station. <clears throat> I know we haven't started, but play some heavy metal. Also, hair is on fleek. Looks awesome. Thank you so much. Um, yes, I will play some heavy metal for you guys as soon as we get in here. Aw, oh, thank you for gifting a sub to Zykerkova. I stole your fruit. Thank you. It never snows there. It do It rarely snows here, because I do live in the south. Um, but we are supposed to get a couple inches today, which is a lot for us. Everybody freaks out. You've had no snow this winter in Maine? It's negative 30 in Montana? Oh my god. <laughs> That is cold. That is balls cold. Oh, thank you so much for another thousand bits. That is so sweet. Thank you so much. Uh, I stole your fruit. Wow, negative four there. Oof. It's like 18 or 19 degrees Fahrenheit here, which to me is really cold. All right, let me check the game. Okay, we're in. Now I'm just going to uh, load Strange Town, and we're good to go, y'all. So, yeah, we're going back to Barb and Margaret today. We're going to finish up their round, and then we're going to go play Tank and Erin, and their little twin daughters, Mitchie and Odette. Uh, thank you so much, Dino Queen B, for the five-month three-sub. I really appreciate that. It's windy here, too. It's windy here, too. I don't know what that is in Celsius. Let's see. 19 degrees Fahrenheit to Celsius. It's negative seven degrees Celsius here. So it's cold. Yay, Hype Train! Thank you for the 300 bits! I stole your fruit, thank you! That's freezing. That's freezing. Yeah. Um, I almost couldn't make it. I, just going in and out of the grocery store, I was like, oh, I'm gonna die! Okay, let's see. We are in Strange Town, so let me, got, let me get you guys over here. Hold on a second. Let me get you into the game with me. Here we are. Now I think I'm going to have to change because we were in The Sims 3. I got to switch it to Sims 2. There we go. Aha! It's negative one in Indiana. Oh, yeah. It's cold. Oh, thank you so much, Shoujo Trash, for the 24 months. I really appreciate that. Hi, Sophie Sims. Okay, y'all, so let's go load up Barb and Margaret here and get started. We were doing we were doing pretty well with the bot shop. It's kind of difficult, right? It's kind of difficult to keep the bot shop stocked. Because the people in Strange Town, they love robots and they buy out all of her stock as fast as she can get it on the shelves. Barbara! <laughs> it's negative one Celsius Celsius in Switzerland. Wow, it's colder here than it is in Switzerland. 19 degrees Fahrenheit to Celsius. I just want to make sure I read that. Yes, negative 7 degrees Celsius. That's what Google is telling me, is what, is what it is here. It's going to be negative 11 in Illinois. Oof. That is cold. Okay, y'all, you know how it takes it a minute to load the first household. I'm sorry. We'll just have a little chat while we're waiting on it to load. How did Barb and Margaret meet and join the rotation? They met in college. So they were friends of our si our first Sims that went to college. And they fell in love, I believe, and got engaged while they were in college. And then we had to play them after that. <laughs> Secondhand said there needs to be a mod that, that the bots buy a are buyable in buy mode. As I never get to use them due to my Sims not crafting bots. Yeah. I w I'm surprised there's not a mod for that. Uh, it went really well yesterday, Annie Shell. Thank you so much for asking. I had a great time. Got to see my nephew and my two nieces. But I didn't get to see everybody. My sister's supposed to be coming today. She couldn't come yesterday, which really sucked. She had like a last minute thing come up. Okay, here we're going into the family. Oh, and also they have all these pets. Barb and Margaret have all these pets. Uh, they have two dogs and a cat. They love their animals. Neither of them have, have wanted to have children. Um, Margaret is just climbing the career ladder in the journalism career. And Barb is working on her uh, shop. And they're raising their little animals. They're just a happy little family. Uh, thank you so much, Golden Circus Girl, uh, for the Prime sub. I really appreciate that. They are what you wish you could be. <laughs> 
they did move in together after college. Yeah, they did. Okay, so... Uh, right here at the end... Oh my gosh, give it a minute to load, I guess. It's getting a little, uh, choppy. So, right here, we have Barb out here working on her bots. It's 8.02 p.m., though, and she's getting pretty tired. I think we're gonna tell her to cool it on the bots. Let's see how many she has in her inventory. She has one toy robot in her inventory is all she has right now. We recently... So, Margaret actually bought the shop for Barb, and we just recently transferred the deed over to Barb's name. She also hired Judy Smith... Uh, to come and work in the shop because Judy also has an interest in robotics. So she is recent. She's our recent employee, and she's going to come help us make bots. And uh, that's probably what I'm going to put her to work doing in the beginning, just because we need inventory right now. Or maybe I'll have Barb do it, and she can work the cash register. I don't know. Uh, but right now she needs to go get something to eat, and let's get some leftovers. She can stop working for the night. It's 8 p.m. Barb. She works so hard, y'all. <laughs> Oh, thank you so much. I stole your fruit for the 10 gift subs. I really appreciate that. Thank you so much for giving gift subs to iSims447, Merit, Mar Mara Marawis, Little Libby Lou, Addy1398, Addy Casper 1703, Jen the Batty, Graceful Shelf 37, Rachel 53, and Ruffinelli. Thank you so much. You are so generous today. Barb is the owner now of the shop. Yeah, we transferred the deed to her. So I've got the deed um, is in her inventory here. So we're going to, I'm going to keep the deed in her pocket, in her pocket, in her inventory. But we're going to hang up the first simoleon award uh, in the shop when we get back over there. Uh, you started an Uber hood. Funny story, Brandy has two bolts with Laszlo and Juliet Cap is crushing on rip grinds. Wow. <laughs> Oh, uh, yeah. Thank you so much, guys. That is so nice. Did I get everybody? Yeah, I think I did. Okay, so Barb's gonna eat her salad. Margaret is so popular. She is constantly talking on the phone. But she needs to take some time and work on her to get her promotion. She needs charisma skill and creativity. And all she does is talk on the phone all night long every night. She loves talking on the phone. I've never had a sim talk on the phone as much as she does. It's time to hang up. Hang up the phone. And look, she's exhausted, too. Hang up and go get you some food. Because you guys need to go to bed. She never has time to work on her promotion. <laughs> oh, thank you so much, Cass with Class, for gifting a sub to Vixie. Thank you so much. Um, eat some of that, whatever that is. Somebody else is calling already. Like, no. No. She cannot talk on the phone right now. She's got to, like, take care of her basic needs. Sorry. <laughs> Um, I believe you just click on the sim and there's an option to transfer deed. If you're trying to transfer deed, I think you can just... Or maybe you you click on the deed itself. How did we do it? Come here. Come here. Come here. Take the deed out and click on it. That's what you do. You take the deed out of the inventory and then click on it and you'll have the option. That's how I did it. Your Strange Town Saturday is my Roman Empire. Thank you. Uh, okay, Barb. Barb's going to answer the phone, and I know it's going to be for Margaret. No, Margaret cannot talk right now. Dang, leave us alone. I feel like we're being harassed. <laughs> oh, yeah, you can do it from the PC. That is true. You can do it from the PC. I think you can go to real estate. You can order a deed. I don't know. Maybe you can do it from the PC. I don't, I don't know if you can do it from the phone. But they don't have a PC in here, do they? Oh, yes, they do. Jesus. Um, let's see. Is it under real estate? You can sell owned a lot, but I don't want to do that. Um, I'm not exactly sure. The easiest way is just to click on the deed. <laughs> yeah, Barb's probably like, leave my wife alone. Okay, oh, yeah, in, in Alabama, one of their dogs ran away, y'all, and I don't think he's ever coming back, unfortunately. Because I don't think there's an animal control officer to bring him back. So I think he's going to be gone forever. I don't know what to do about that. I wonder if we can teleport him back. Let's see. Can we teleport him back? Does anybody know? And will it will that register as him not being run away? Like, I don't know. Hmm. Oops. 
Aw, oh, thank you so much, Carolot Beginnings, for the six-month Prime sub. I really appreciate that. Um, I, I, call, I did report him missing. I did, but that but they still haven't brought him back. Thank you so much, Jordy Bears, for the 13 months at Tier 1. And I don't know where to find him under here, so... Ugh. Oh, you can do... you. Okay, Laura says you can click on the person and click... Propo it's under propose, y'all. Propose transfer lot ownership. So that's probably the easiest way to do it. Go to propose. Yeah, it is realistic that pets, runaway pets don't always return. I agree. I agree. Okay, so we're just going to let him stay right. The cat beat him up and he ran away, which is really sad. It's really sad. Okay, clean this up, and then you need to go take a shower, and then you guys need to go to bed, because we have another long, hard day of running the shop tomorrow. And I think, does Margaret have work tomorrow? Let's check. Uh, she does, so she definitely needs to get some sleep now. You're really excited to see what my Sims 4 project is? I was working on it this morning. I was planning on working on it all day today, but now I'm not going to be able to after the stream. I'm going to work on it all day tomorrow, and hopefully I'll have something ready to show you guys in tomorrow's stream. <laughs> and we'll probably work on it together in tomorrow's stream, actually. Choo-choo! I do not have all the packs, no. I don't have for rent yet. I don't even have growing together yet. Um, tomorrow I'm not gonna do Test of Time. Tomorrow I'm gonna do a Sims 4 because I want to share something that I'm working on. Um, yeah, we could buy a better bed for them, but I don't want to go into their savings yet. I am going to play Test of Time Challenge again. I'm just not going to play it tomorrow. Okay, Margaret, time for bed. Go to sleep. It's 1030. Oh my gosh, dogs, animals, what's wrong? What's up with you? Let's check on our remaining pets. We don't want them to run away. Okay, uh, Boots is doing okay. Clark, Clark, don't be a jerk. Oh my gosh, these two, the cat does not get along with the dogs at all. Uh, Margaret, what are you doing? Go to bed. I don't know what that was about. She was just standing there, thinking about woohoo. <laughs> You're working on cleaning your hole today? Yeah, we've been cleaning nonstop for like two days. I had three little kids over here yesterday. <laughs> oh my gosh. You did hear Project and Sims 4. Hello, J Survivor. <laughs> okay, I'm going to speed things up so we can get through the night here. So, let me see. Two days left in spring. Okay, so we've got one day left to play them. Um, tomorrow. And I really want to work on the shop tomorrow. Um, after this, we will be playing... Uh, Tank, Tank and Aaron will be next. After we finish Barb and Margaret. You're cleaning while you're watching. <laughs> Am I modding Sims 4 to hell so it can become more playable? Well, of course. <laughs> Absolutely I am. And by the way, I have updated my Sims 4 mods list and all of my Sims 4 guides. Ooh, 1800. Oh my god. I gotta stop. And all of my uh, guides on my website as well. I did finish doing that. To the best of my ability. I fixed all broken links, deleted the irrelevant mods that aren't good anymore, added the new ones that I'm going to be using. So check that out on my website, PleasantSims.com, and my guide on how I play rotationally and my, and my Sims 4 gameplay rules. Thank you, Hendrick. And hello, Hendrick. Uh, Hendrick posted a link in the chat. Oh my god! Thank you so much, Just Ollie 92 for giving out 20 gift subs. Jeez Louise, thank you so much for that. That is so kind of you. Um, for giving gift subs to Melanie356, Frizzed, um, AlsJ428, Kane Mauled, Choppy Slotkey, Live and Hole 2, <laughs> uh, EVT333, Emma Bav98, Melanie Stinker, Sophie, Sophie M. Haha, -ha, Florida, Candid Harsher, Ecto Slimy, Simmon for Life, Wicked Pixel, My, The Mike 64, Sim Shake, Blissful Siren 52, Lovely Live 94, and Shaylin Christine. Wow, thank you so much, Just, Just Ollie. That is so kind of you. 
Um, and thank you so much, Cass with Class, for gifting a sub to Marius Carlos. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You've been playing Sims 4 rotationally with my guide since around 2021, and it's amazing. Yay! Um, alerts are playing for me. Are you guys not hearing them? There are not Sims in the Strange Town Jail right now. No, there are not. <laughs> um, the only thing that's changed for my Sims 2 rules recently is that I'm not using secondary aspirations right now. Um, just because they're too overpowering. Alright, these, these two need to get ready for work. I haven't been paying any attention. I'm, okay, you do, cannot paint right now. Go, You're about to pee your pants. I know you want fun, but you gotta pee. Go eat some breakfast and barb... You, you eat your breakfast and then you can go pee. We gotta get ready to open up the shop today. Crap, I forgot the self-employed mod. Dang it. I've been so distracted with my Sims 4 stuff. No, I forgot to get it. Um, I do have it on my list for whatever that's worth. Not much. <laughs> oh crap, bills are due today. Yes, we will play another round of jail at the end of this round. That is right. Because we have a, a townie is going to jail. For being creepy as hell. <laughs> okay, let's see. Get yourself some... Whatever that was. Banana bread. Oh my gosh, we need to clean this out too. Um, Barb, when you get done, clean the dog bowl and fill the bowl up. And who's peeing all over the floor? Oh my god. Oh, these animals. And we need to clean this too. Take care of your pets, girls. Come on. Hurry up and eat your breakfast salad. Margaret's got to be at work in one hour, so Barb's going to have to take care of this mess. And Margaret, why don't you go paint while you're waiting? Oh, you gotta, you're going to drive. She's going to drive to work. Never mind. I forgot I made her the owner of the car, so she's going to drive to work after she finishes breakfast. Yes, I hate having a family sim with secondary romance, too. If I have a family sim with secondary romance, then I will just have them only romance their spouse. Um, did you ever get the Trans Scars mod? Um, no, I have not gotten that mod. Um, how will you play Trans Sims if you play them? I haven't really worked that out yet. Yeah, Kendall was being creepy with the team. No, you cannot. Don't even answer the phone. Don't even answer the phone. Mop this up, and we gotta get over to the shop. But she had to take care of the pets really quick before she went to work today, because their pet bed was all stinky as hell. And their bowl was all stinky. And she can't just leave this puddle of pee in the floor. She's going to have to mop that up too before she goes. Um, I'm not using the favorite color mod in this game. No, I'm not. Um, yeah, that's I, I like that idea. That, that spiteful cat says, I go by vibes with my secondaries. Like, Brandy being primary family and secondary pleasure just makes too much sense to me. That does make sense. And Dustin being primary wealth and secondary family. Yeah, I like those ideas too. Um, thank you so much, Neon Angel, for the prime sub. No, do not answer that phone. Oh, are they calling about Alabama? Oh, I'm so glad she answered the phone. They were calling about Alabama. Yes. We're getting our dog back. Oh my god. I, I almost made her not answer. If I wasn't reading the chat, I would have totally made her not answer because I thought they were calling for Margaret. Okay, we gotta, now we gotta stay here and wait on our pet before she goes to open the shop. That's way more important. Shop is gonna be opened late today, everybody, because we got a pet emergency. I know! I am gonna buy him a collar. I will buy him a collar. Clean up, clean up. Um, I gotta go to the pet store and buy him a collar. That's an errand that uh, Barb needs to run. Or maybe we'll have Margaret do it when she gets home. Oh, here, wait, no, that's our maid. No, that's, that's not. What, what? You brought the, who, what? You brought the dog back? Okay, Alabama. I don't understand what happened, but look at his needs. Oh my gosh, we have to go love on him. At le we're gonna let him eat first. And then we're gonna go give him love. Rub belly, stroke, feed treat. Why are you just, hey, I didn't say you could watch my TV. What are you doing? You're not even, okay, I don't. All right, I don't know what's happening here. Why is he, why did this maid bring the dog back and why is he just chilling on my couch watching TV right now? <laughs> Hi, Princess Goldfur. Aw, look, Alabama's home. Aw, I'm so glad he's here. 
Let me just make sure. Barb's about to pee her pants. She's trying to take care of this dog. Okay, well, he's got food. Um, there's not really too much more I can do for him right now. So, I think she's going to have to go to the bathroom. Give him a little bit more. Play with him a little bit. And then she's got to go to work. So, maid wants to be rewarded. Uh, what's your opinion on Sims 4 kits? You know? <coughs> oh, my gosh. I, uh mind the kits like I probably wouldn't buy all of them but if it's something that interests me I just see it like a little stuff pack so I like I like having the option like I think there was a plants one that I really wanted to buy because I can never have too many plants um I don't mind them I think it's nice to have extra content but I mean I, I'm not gonna buy the ones that don't interest me I get one hour of free Netflix. You get Alabama. Okay, she's got to go to work now. Oh my gosh, we gotta go. Sorry, Alabama. You're just gonna have to stay here and take care of yourself. He's sleeping. He's so tired. Okay, we're gonna let him rest. And <coughs> she needs to change into her everyday outfit. She's not going to work in her jammies. Oh, there's a grunge style one? Yeah, I gotta get that. Last pack you bought was Growing Together. I haven't bought Growing Together yet, but that's the next one I'm going to get. Okay, let's walk to Community Lot. And let's go get started. Um, just, just, nope, just me. Going over to, going next door to Barb's Bots. Our tiny little robot shop in town. Yeah, the kids are kind of like Sims 3 store content. I think that's a really good point. Yeah, that's exactly right. Only I think they're more affordable aren't they than the sims 3 store content was or is because you can still buy the sims 3 store content yeah and i like having the option you know and i need to look through all the kits that have come out and see if there are any i want to get oh what does she want to do oh she wants to buy a collar okay let me lock that in she wants to buy a collar and get a i'm gonna lock in silver robotics she also wants to be friends with judy who is her protege but right now, we need to open up, open the business, and then we need to restock a robot. She does have one in her inventory she can restock here. Stop bird watching. What are you doing? Get to work. Get to work. <laughs> and Judy will not be here until the afternoon because she's in school. Hopefully, it doesn't call her in before then. Yeah, the maid just stayed behind playing the console. Whatever. Um, Whatever. <laughs> Aw, oh, Barb was thinking about Margaret as she worked. Isn't that cute? There's a broken robot. Somebody's gonna buy that for 124 simoleons. Is it gonna be you, Vidkin? Are you gonna buy her broken robot? Yeah, she's scared. she was scared Alabama runs away again. Uh, hello, Trista. Have a look at our wares. In the meantime, no, you cannot jump rope. You cannot jump rope. You gotta, jeez, you gotta get out here and make some more robots. Oops, I don't know what that is. Uh, delete it, whatever it is. Stop jump roping. Please stop jump roping. Jeez, Barb, get it together. Get out here and make some robots until you need to run, ring somebody up. And I'm not going to call in employees until 2 o'clock whenever. Or is it 1 o'clock when the teens get home from school? Okay, she's got another robot to stock. So let's put that in her inventory and have her go restock it. Oh, no, there, is that Judy? Okay, Judy's here. I guess she took off work early to come work. So, uh, management, I am going to have her actually uh, be the cashier today so that Barb can work on making bots right now. Barb's thinking about that kiss. <laughs> Judy, get in here. Oh, she hasn't assigned the job yet. She hasn't assigned the job yet. Okay, she's restocking. We need to sell, too, actually. Oh, Vidkin bought a robot. Awesome. Now go tell her, hello, Judy. Welcome back to work. I need you to run the cash register today, please. All right, awesome. And that means she can take care of that, and Barb can go back here and work on... We need to make... Um... I'm just gonna make a bunch of I'm just gonna make a bunch of toy robots because those are fast to make and they sell pretty well. Let's watch Judy on the cash register, y'all. The smoke on the robots means they're broken. So she's got a couple broken robots up there. 
All right, yeah, just make these toy robots. What? Are you unhappy, Abjeet? Jeez, she's trying her best. It's like her first day on the cash register. Give her a break. <laughs> yeah, I do need to I do need to add some decorations to the store because it's pretty bare bones here. And uh, oh, by the way, let's hang up the first Simoleon award. We're going to hang that up. Um I want to hang it on the wall back here. Dang it. Here, I'm just going to take it out for a minute, and then I'm going to go into build mode. So I can put the walls up and get it where I want it to go. Yeah, right there behind the cash register. I think it's a good place for the Simoleon Award. And while we're here, let's see. I know there's like a robot poster. Let's find the robot poster and at least put that up. At least we'll have something in here. Okay, where's the robot poster? Isn't there a robot poster or have I lost my mind? Okay, not that. This one, yes, robot lunch. So we're gonna hang a robot lunch over here. There's, there's one decoration in the store, that's something. Aw, oh, thank you so much for the 39 months! Oh my gosh, Metaphysica, thank you so much. I really appreciate that. I think that's my longest sub, is 39 months. I don't know, somebody might have had 40. I don't know. <laughs> and then, is there anything else robot-related? And is there anything else we can sell? Because we were looking for, like, those toy robots, but they were super expensive. What is that? Oh, that's a spooky, scary stand-up. Yeah, we were looking for the buyable toy robots, but they were, like, really expensive. Do -do -do. Do -do -do. But there's, like, there's nothing else robot-related that I feel like we could sell here. Barb just needs to make a bunch of toy bots. And maybe I should see if there's some custom content I could download. Robot-related custom content, y'all. The giant bulb lamp. Ooh, that's a good idea. That's a really good idea. I like that. That looks like it goes, doesn't it? We could do... We could sell one of all of... Well, they're so big. They don't... We need more... We'll sell those over here. There we go. Green. Orange. And blue. Get your robot lamps. Get your robot lamps here. All right, Barb, we're going to set this for sale. Average. Right now, I'm going to do average until the store gets a little bit more popular. It gets another rank up. I'm just going to sell everything at average prices. Okay, she finally got somebody checked out. Good job, Judy. Good job, Judy. Come on, you can do it. She's getting a little bit faster. At the, at the cash register. It's turning into an electronic store. No! It's robots and little weird lamps only. <laughs> oh, I forgot about the heavy metal, too. I'm so sorry. I forgot about the heavy metal. Um, we don't have a radio in here, but I'll play it when we get back to their house. I gotta hydrate earlier. A save game. Oh my gosh. I'll save the game. I'll do a hydrate. Sorry, y'all. Oh, repair tools. That's good. Yes, that's good. And then a screenshot. Oh my gosh, this is a great screenshot right here, actually. Of Judy trying her best to check out Vidkin. And he's like, what is going on? <laughs> what is wrong with you? Print screen. And then let me see if I can get... I want to get another one of Judy. Her first job, y'all. I'm proud of her. I'm proud of her. She's got acne and everything. She still came to work. There, that's good. <laughs> I could put heavy metal speakers on the wall. I don't know, though. I don't know if I want to do that. Uh, Vidkin bought a, a toy robot, so that's cool. <laughs> And Barb's still out there making robots, but we still have several more in here to sell, so. What are these two doing? Edward and Abjit. Do they have exactly the same hair? They look like twins. Oh. 
<laughs> Don't get in a fight in my store. Don't get in a fight in my store. Oh, hello, Samuel. Samuel subject is here. Techno would make more sense, yeah. Vidkin bought it for his child. That's what I was thinking. So, will Judy get paid her salary when you return to the Smiths, or will you have to cheat her the wages she gets? I think she's actually getting it, but I think it's going to the household. Blonde boys buying robots. I'll probably just open up a, a savings account for her and put some of it in there. A lot of blondes in here. Last time it was a bunch of redheads. <laughs> if they get in a fight, they can go to jail. We'll, all the townies will go to jail together at the end. Oh, that was nice, Abjeet. You came and greeted Judy. Okay, Barb, I'm gonna, about to send you to restock here in a minute. How many does she have in her inventory now? She has. She's made three so far, so she's doing really well. We also do need to make another... I need to get the mod... I'm not- I need to get the mod to sell the cleaning bots and stuff, which I did not do. So right now, I'm just, we're just gonna sell toy robots and lamps. Oh look, Edward bought a lamp! Awesome. Come on, Judy, you can do it. You can do it, I believe in you. You're getting better at the cash register. Oh, Samuel bought a toy robot. He bought the broken one, oh my gosh. Aw, uh, thank you so much, Feline Insomnia, for the 14 months of Tier 1. I really appreciate that. <laughs> Kindle break the law, sin. <laughs> yes, the things they buy do show up in their inventories when you play them. Yes. Yes, they have everything that they buy. So if I were to play Edward, he would have that lamp in his inventory. I love that about The Sims 2. Well, we have we have place we have space for two people in jail right now. All right, Samuel, are you going to check out or what? Oh my gosh, General Buzz came in. What do you want in here, General Buzz? Seem does not seem like a store you would be a patron of. Um, Barb, how you doing in here? We also, eventually, I would like to build a little break room onto the store so that they can get food because she's already getting hungry. All right, I'm going to have her stop there and go restock because we are selling out. Go restock, Barb. And Samuel bought something. He's checking out now. <laughs> Buzz wants drones to shoot aliens with. Sounds right. Sounds right. <laughs> Get ripped. Oh, that didn't play. You're right. Get ripped didn't play. I don't know why. Um, On her own, asked Cindy, how do you manage with running a store like the wages, expenses, etc.? How do you keep track of hours? I just, I don't know. I just wing it. I don't really have any set way that I do it. I just wing it, as you can see here. <coughs> he better not say anything to my sweet Judy, General Buzz. You better stay away from- I love Judy. <laughs> he better not be here to harass Judy. He bought a lamp. Thank you, General Buzz. All right, Barb, what are you doing? Did you restock all the robots yet? No, she's got four more to restock. Okay, restock, restock, restock restock and then also restock the lamps and then let's see i also want to look at her um, income and stuff a cash tracker so cash flow to date 1334 current session um negative 227 so she spent more on inventory than she's made so actually i'm not going to have her stock the lamps yet we need to make some more money first oh hey jade came by to visit judy at work oops i didn't mean to do that Coming from Arkansas, how did you survive your first snowy winter in Colorado? It was hard. And now I'm like, I'm so used to the Arkansas again already. Even though this is my first winter back, I'm like, oh my god, it's too cold. I'm so glad. I'm so glad our winter lasts like two days here. It was really rough that first winter. <coughs> but I got used to it after a couple years. Hello, big titty goth cat. <laughs> You're so hungover. I'm glad you could make it. What? She's buying the lambs for 40 and selling them for 41? Is she seriously only making one simoleon on those? She's not making much on these. She's, she uh, makes these for 108 and she's selling them for 124 Which is not great. Did General Buzz buy two lamps? And he's not done. He's still shopping. Oh my god. Okay. Let me... Um... No, I'm not in Colorado. I lived in Colorado for the last 10 years, but I'm in Arkansas now. I just moved back this year. All right. I don't want to do expensive. I can't do expensive yet. I don't think we're to the point where we can do expensive. 
But if those lamps... Hold up, hold up. Oh my god, are they seriously selling for 41? That is not gonna work. Yeah, right now she is making losses because she's paying Judy as well. Yeah. Okay, she restocked all those. General Buzz needs to hurry up and pay for his stuff and maybe we can get ahead a little bit. Have a car now? The sh it's, it's actually difficult. Oh man, she does not like Abjeet. Wow, what did he just say? She's doing a school cheer for him and he's like, no, I don't want to hear that. Um, oh, thank you so much, Bectorius, for the 18-month Prime sub. Barb, get the phone. I really appreciate that. Thank you. Okay, Barb cannot get the phone. Okay, we need to move the phone, I'm realizing now. Um, because she cannot get to that when Judy's at the cash register. Alright, now answer the phone. Oh, it's 7 o'clock! Okay, we're gonna have to close up the shop now. I feel like I'm violating child labor laws. Abjeet, go away! Go away! Trying to answer the phone here. Is that... Who is that? I don't know who that is calling. General Buzz is still... Who is he buying... Who is he buying all these robots for? Um... I love open for business lots too. They are hard and challenging, but they are worth it. Yeah, I do plan to do my Build-A-City challenge again. I, d I thought that was Samuel, but I don't think it is. I think it's... It's not. It's... It's Amin. I don't know why he's calling. He's asking about the robots or something, I guess. <laughs> okay, so as soon as Judy checks these people out, or as soon as Barb gets off the phone, we are going to close the business for the day. And I will double check our cats. Ooh, we're, we've almost broken even today. So that's good. Um, general, oh, did we break even after General Buzz? Not quite. Not Negative 65, so not too bad. Oh, no, we just went, we just paid, we just paid more. Oh, negative 87. Okay, get off the phone. This kid has talked to you long enough. <laughs> She's talking to some teenage boy. I love that idea secondhand. Like, that was my whole idea with the Build-A-City Challenge is to have a neighborhood where you can't use buy mode and your sim has to go to the store to buy furniture. Like, that's what I wanted to happen. That's what I wanted to do. I thought it was such an awesome idea. Okay, nope, business is clo We're closed, Benny. Oh, ring up these customers. What is, where did Judy go? Did she just, did she go home? We've got to ring up the last customer. You didn't even ring up your own sister, Judy. She's like, I need to go to the bathroom. I'm sorry, you're going to have to take this last one. Um, I can lower the wages, but your sims can get mad and leave if you don't pay them enough. So I'm going to leave her wage as it is right now. <laughs> Um, did I say thank you so much, Bectorius, for the 18 months? Thank you if I didn't say so. Yeah, Judy needed a break. Okay, no, we're closed, Benny. Get the hell out. We're closed. And I'm going home now. I don't know why I just put the walls up. That was weird. Um, uh, we're about to walk home. Bus the shop is closed. It's almost 9 o'clock. Jeez, Barb's working late today. Come on. We're out of here. Get out. Get out, everybody. Get out. <laughs> All right. Barb's closing up shop and going home. Um, I can't restock because I don't. she didn't have any robots left to restock. She's got to make some more. Yeah, the profit is super low right now. Like, she's not making any money. <laughs> yeah, I agree. I should get a mod to lower the employee wages. I definitely agree. Okay, finally the maid left. So now we just have to keep an eye on the animals until Margaret gets home. Uh, Margaret gets home at 4 p.m. So just a couple more hours. I think the animals are doing okay. Alabama. He's sleeping. He's about to have to pee, though. Did he go outside? Oh my gosh, what's happening? Margaret's home. She earned 999 simoleons. Heck yeah. Alabama peed outside. I'm very proud of him, but he also dug a hole, I think. All right, what do you think Margaret's going to do as soon as she gets home? What do you think she's going to do? Talk on the phone? Oh, my God. No, hang up. She can't talk now. Oh, wow, we're just getting a discount in home furnishings? Heck, yeah, thank you. 
she also wants to buy a collar for a pet. So, you know what? We're going to go to the store real quick. First of all, she is she needs to give love to Alabama. Because this is her first time seeing him since he ca he got home. And they're not even friends yet, but she does like him. She's too busy talking on the phone all the time. I will look for treasure. Uh, how many relationships does Margaret have? A lot. She has a lot of friends. Look at all these friends. She's got a ton of friends. She's not friends with any of her own pets, though, because all she does is talk on the phone. Okay, Alabama's doing well for once. So, Margaret, why don't you go use the turlet, and then we are going to head over uh, to the shop and get a collar. She's trying to go. What, what are you doing? Why are you just standing there? Yeah, she's friends with Blair. Yeah. Barb became playable because she was a friend of our Sims in college. And she and Margaret got engaged and we just loved them so much that we added them <laughs> to the game. Okay, time to go. So, you can take the car actually, Margaret. We're gonna go somewhere. Oh, I guess I have to click on her. Um, or not. Why, why can't I go somewhere? Okay, that's weird. I can't even click on her and click go to community lot. Maybe, do I have to call? Um... Oh, because Barb is out. Oh, so we have to wait till Barb gets home at 9 p.m. Oh my gosh. Okay. Who peed in the floor? First of all, I'm gonna go mop that up. Oh, do you see the kitty climbing down the tree? All right. Well, we'll have to wait till Barb gets home then. In the meantime, we'll try to take care of Margaret here. I'm gonna have her actually cook some food because they don't have much but like salad and bread. So let's have, and she has a high uh, cooking skill. Let's make a meatloaf tonight. Make a meatloaf tonight. Oh no, we have no food. <laughs> She's got to go to the store. Okay, let's eat leftovers. She's got to go to the store so she can get groceries while she picks up the collar at the strip mall. Eat some food, do some treasure hunting, you know, just the usual things you do at home. When you're waiting on your lady to get home. I gotta hydrate a minute ago. I'm sorry. Let me hydrate for you. I love grocery stores and The Sims too, also. Oh, look at our puppies playing together. Alabama and Boots. Aw, I hope they become friends. Let's check on Alabama. He's doing okay. He's a little hungry. He's gonna need a bath soon. But he's doing alright overall. Um, yes, I did put the pet collars object in the pet store. I'm like 100%. I'm like 99% sure I did. I started to say 100, but now I'm like... There's, there is a small percentage chance that I didn't, but I'm pretty sure I did. No, they don't have kids. They have pets. They have Alabama, Boots, and uh, Clark. They're dinks, that's right. Double income, no kids. <laughs> okay, well why don't you go take a shower while you're waiting. And you, you could do something to work on your promotion in the meantime. She does need creativity and she needs fun. So we'll have her go um, continue her painting. Um, the dogs are both boys. I believe all their animals are boys. Or no, no, no. That's not true. Alabama's a girl? Alabama's a girl. I didn't even realize that. Um, but Boots and Clark are boys. But Alabama's a girl. Aw, sweet Alabama. Sweet home Alabama. <laughs> we yeah, one of the pants should be called one of the pets should be called pants so we can have boots and pants and boots and pants. <laughs> we could have puppies. I didn't even think about that. Sweet home Alabama. <laughs> I know the dogs were growling at each other. Uh, Margaret's going to practice her painting here until Barb gets home. And I might just have Barb go in the morning and get the groceries and the collar. Because I think they're both going to be kind of too tired to go out tonight. It's going to be like 9 o'clock before Barb gets home. She really kept the store open late tonight because we had a lot of customers. A boy should be named Oklahoma. 
A puppy should be named Oklahoma if it's a boy. Um, I don't know. Do Boots and Alabama get along? They're close to being friends. Boots and uh, Clark are friends. Boots is sweet. Boots is friends with everybody. But Clark and Alabama do not get along at all. Wait. Yes, they do. They're friends. What the heck? Okay, never mind. I don't know why, but see, Clark was really mean to Alabama and Alabama ran away. But now they're friends. So I guess they, I guess they made up. I love that. <laughs> Margaret, you're so close to getting your level up. Oh my gosh, you're almost there. And, okay, Barb is home. Why, how, why did you come from that way, Barb? What the heck? She also wants to slow dance. What are you doing, Floyd? Acting real creepy out here. Hey, let's, let's dig in this hole. Dig for treasure. Wait, don't go in. Dig for treasure. And wait, what was she trying to do? Let's get the mail, too. Dig, Barb, dig! Dig! Uh, oh, no! Oh, no! No, no, no! We hit a, we hit a water line! Fill it in! Fill it in! Barb! Fill it in! Hurry! Oh, my gosh! Oh, my gosh! Oops! 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 Okay, that didn't go well. Uh, pay your bills. And then she's gotta get inside immediately. She needs to eat... Margaret's still in here going at her painting. <laughs> she broke the water main. Yep, she did. She paid the bills. She's going to go in and get something to eat. Take care. I think I'm going to have her take a bath because she needs comfort. She's been standing in those stiletto heels all day long. She needs comfort. Yeah, I'd do life stories or pet stories. Yeah, I would do a stream of that. <laughs> I'm not going to send Margaret to the store tonight. I'm going to wait till tomorrow because it's already so late. It's already like 1030. She needs to get ready to go to bed. I was hoping that she would get the skill point she needed before bed. And do the, the animals need food too. Let's have her go fill the bowl. Fill that bowl. There you go. All right. And say hi to Boots. Uh, give, him a, give him a treat. He's hungry. Give him a treat. How long has he been hungry? Oh my gosh. There you go. Alright, so Margaret needs to go to sleep. I'm gonna have her just give give Barb a little hug. Give her a little hug. You guys haven't seen each other all day. <laughs> Neither she wants to influence someone to clean. I think she wants to ask Barbara ask Barb if she'll clean. Can you clean the house? I'm busy. I'm busy talking on the phone and being a journalist. <laughs> Alright, you go to bed and let's take care of the rest of Margaret's needs. Oh my gosh, my nose is itchy. I'm sorry. Um Use the bathroom and uh, take a bubble bath. They do need another bowl, but there's really not anywhere to put one in the house. So I just try to keep it filled up. I could probably put it in the office like right here. If I did another bowl, that would probably work. Oh, hey, Alabama. What were you growling? Oh my gosh, what were you growling at? I, let's look at their traits really quick. No, not relationships. What am I doing? Unemployed. Um, okay, so Alabama is friendly and a genius, but also aggressive. Boots is cowardly and, and independent. And Clark is friendly and a genius and aggressive. Clark has the same personality as Alabama. You spent six hours in five degrees Celsius? Oh my gosh. That sounds rough. I hope you get warm. <laughs> Clark, you need to go eat. Go eat. Okay, Barb, you're gonna have to go to sleep now. I know you're still a little bit hungry, but... Um, somebody's gotta go to the grocery store and to get the pet collar in the morning. And I know the, the day is about to change, but I think we'll still go do that. First, before I switch households, just because um, I, I don't want to forget to do it when we get back to them. You make your pets work their asses off. Uh, somebody peed on the floor. I didn't even see who did it either. And I think Alabama's going to need a bath soon. Yep. Yep. Yeah, Emma, you need some hot drinks. <laughs> it is funny. Pets can have jobs. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to speed things up. Actually, I'm going to save right here. 
I still forgot the heavy metal. Dang it. We'll play some heavy metal in the morning, too. Three things I must do. Don't run away, Alabama. Don't run away. Oh my gosh. You stink. Alright. We're waking up. It's six in the morning. It has changed. The day has changed to the next season, but I'm going to go ahead and have Barb um, go to the store. So change into your everyday, and then we're going to walk over to... Because she doesn't, she can't take the car because Margaret needs to go to work. So she's going to walk over to the store, get groceries, get a pet collar. I didn't get anything from my Strange Town sticky note. No, I have get self-employed mod, get prisoner clothes, and get the cleaning bot cell mod. I still need to do all three of those. <clears throat> I've been, I've been distracted with another project I've been working on. Okay, let's go to the Desert Sand Strip Mall. The pup passed out next to the pee paddle. Pea puddle. Jeez, try to say that five times fast. The pup passed out next to the pea puddle. <laughs> Alright, come on, Barb. Get to the store. Get to the strip mall at 6.45 in the morning. <clears throat> oh my goodness, y'all. It's soaking into the hardwood floors. Ew! Well, hopefully they're treated so it doesn't soak in too much before somebody can clean it up. Yes, time to go shopping. Alright, Barb. First of all, and by the way, if you like this strip mall set right here, you can download it on my website. Not set, but lot. If you like this lot, you can download it on my website at PleasantSims.com. Go under Sims 2 Downloads. It's called Desert Sand Strip Mall. It does use some custom content, but I have it all linked there. So, we're, first of all, we're going to go get groceries. Um, I love this lot. It is a very big lot, so it can get a little laggy, but it's still really fun. Razor Waiter's here. <laughs> oh, you can just buy one collar and use it on all three pets. That's awesome. Okay, so we're going to just fill up the fridge. We're going to buy 600 simoleons worth of food. Um, after their round, we're about to move on to Tank and Aaron. Barb had to go and get some groceries this morning. And she's got to go get a pet collar while she's here. Probably should have done the collar first. Because now she's got to carry those groceries around. And I don't know where she's carrying them. <coughs> okay, here's the pet store over here. And here is the collar. So we're going to go buy a collar here. And yeah, there's lots of stuff for sale in here. And that's a, that's another reason why there's just so many objects on this lot. I really went crazy with it. But um, I love it. <laughs> Come on, Barb. Get in here. Buy your, buy your pet collar. And buy... Oh, you can you not buy one of those? You can only view those? Why can you not buy those? Okay, it froze. It's freezing up for a second. Okay, what do we want to buy? So, Alabama is a girl, but the other two are boys. So, I'm just going to buy, like, a, gen a general collar. I can't really tell what patterns they have on them at all. I'll just buy this, um... I'll buy this, like, black and white one. That's nice. We'll buy that add to cart. Okay. What? Barb! Barb is like, ooh, Brittany, you're looking good today. <laughs> That's alright. It's okay to look, Barb. Um, And then I wanted her to buy some of this dog food, but apparently you can't buy it. You can only view it. Maybe I don't have it set for sale properly or something. I don't know. I need to check on that because none of this stuff is buyable. And it should all be viable, so I don't know. I need to check on that. Maybe I don't have this stuff set for sale properly. Um, okay, Barb, time to go home. And actually, while she's here, she needs to get a bite to eat. I'm going to have her stop over at the restaurant and just get something to eat while she's here. Because she's too hungry to go home and cook. She's going to stop. I think, realistically, she would stop by the restaurant and grab something to eat. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 
She could have got the vending machine. That's true. We should have hit the vending machine. That's okay. Barb's like, I got time. I got time. I'm going to stop and have some breakfast while I'm here. <coughs> Maybe a sim can only buy those if a sim owns the lot. Maybe. Maybe I should have somebody own this lot. I'm sure it's going to be incredibly expensive. Come on, Razor Waiter. Get over here. Take my order. I got to go to work. I need to get my breakfast. So today I'm actually not going to order Chef's Choice for her because she's here at breakfast time. I am going to order... Um, an omelet. She's going to have an omelet this morning. Um, this is Edward and Adam Beaker. Adam Beaker is a teen and he's over here eating with Edward. I don't know what's going on there. Seems a little, seems a little weird. <laughs> that waiter's looking spiky. That's Razor Waiter. We just let him look like that. Crystal curious? Don't, you can't go in the kitchen, Crystal. You don't work here. Get out of there. <laughs> no, not jail. They're not doing anything. They might just be friends. What if they're in the big brother, little brother program or something? What if he's just mentoring him? <laughs> he's named Beaker. Must be that beak. <laughs> Crystal came to get some breakfast this morning, too. We have we can't we haven't seen anything weird between them. Gerard Landry over here. We're gonna be playing Gerard as well. He's now uh, made it into the into the rounds. Barb's just enjoying her omelet here, taking her sweet time. All right, now you have got to pay and get out of here. We do not have time to mess around because when we get back to them, she's gonna have to go to work immediately. All right, Barb, come on, time to go home. Oops, not adjust. Walk to lot, walk home. Just checking out these two. I don't know why they were eating together. That is quite strange. Well, Adam's on his way out. He's late for school. I don't know what's going on with him. And Edward is definitely uh, gay. Did you see him? He was getting the hots for Cooper over here. Cooper's our jailer. So we gotta remember that. Uh, Gerard got promoted to playable because he fathered a child. He had a child, um... Oh man, you played Fire Breathing Dragons and it didn't even play. I stole your fruit. I'm so sorry. I don't know what's going on with sound alerts, y'all. They should be working. I don't know why they're not working. Yeah, Gerard got Chloe, um, prego. And Chloe, ha and Chloe had two twin girls. And so now he's moving in so that we can play him and he can have a relationship with his children. Okay. <clears throat> so, oh, good job, Margaret, for getting your skill up. <clears throat> so we're going to save here. And that's the end of Barb and Margaret. Barb and Margaret? Yeah. Okay. I thought I said Marb and Barbara. <laughs> Barb and Margaret's round. So I'm going to mark that on the spreadsheet. And then we're moving on to Tank and Aaron. So this is going to be fun. I'm going out to the neighborhood here. So Tank and Aaron live in a very, it's, it's a bad, they got a bad situation. Oh, I didn't put the collar on. Dang it. Okay, let's go back in. We got to put the collar on. Good point. Thank you for reminding me. Actually, I think I'll wait till Margaret gets home. Make sure she puts away the groceries and all that so we don't forget. Do, do, do. Marb. Marv and Margaret. <laughs> Marv and Margaret. <laughs> yeah, let's just wait till Barb gets back and then we'll switch over. Because I want to make sure we get everything done today. And then, can she put the collar on yet? I don't know. No. Because I think you just click on the pet to put the collar on him, right? Can she do it? No, because she's not here. Oh, yeah, she does need to wash the dog. Good point. Is she off work today? Wash Alabama. Um, yeah, she's off work today, so great. She can stay here and take care of the pets. Look at the beautiful painting she's painting. Is it in her inventory? She's got groceries, but she doesn't have the collar. Oh, take the pet to the mirror. Okay. Yep, that's how you do it. I forgot. It's been a long time since I've done a collar on a pet. Okay, let's wash. We're going to wash Alabama first. And then we will do... 
change up here is for pet Alabama. We're taking care of Alabama this morning. Sims 2 paintings are better than Sims 4, I agree. For some reason, our, dog, our dogs are getting stuck. Are getting stuck in the uh, bathtub every time I bathe them. And I have to force air and reset them. Okay. And now he's in the floor. He's in the floorboards! Okay, come on. Let's change appearance. Hopefully. There we go. Yeah, Margaret's very creative. Okay, no, we have a coat. We don't want to change her coat. I do have defaults for The Sims 2 paintings, yeah. Those aren't the original ones. Because I got tired of the original ones. But even the original ones are better than The Sims 4. No. There we go. Collar. Yes. Okay, Alabama has a collar now. Aw, how cute. Look at that. And she's clean. Now let's see if we can use the same collar on all of them. As somebody suggested. Um, let's try boots next. It could be the litter box is the problem. But I don't really have anywhere else to put it. Maybe I should move the toilet and the sink over to that wall or something. Nope, you don't have any collar. So you, you do actually have to get a collar for all of them. So, we'll have to remember that. We'll have to come back. But Alabama has her collar, so... And she's the most likely to run away. Okay, as soon as Barb gets back, we're gonna put the groceries away and change over. Come on, Barb. Okay, Barb's back. So, um, put away groceries. Oh, is it because... Oh, it's because it's a big dog collar. Okay. I bought a big dog collar. But I... So, I'm gonna have to buy one anyway because we have a big dog, a small dog, and a cat. So can the small dog and cat share? I don't know. Uh, is Barbara available to talk? Um, no, she's not. She's going to work right now, actually. Okay. After you kiss Margaret. All right, we gotta go. I love Barb and Margaret. I don't want to leave them, but we must. We gotta move on. You need collars for each pet type. Cat, large dog, and small dog. Okay, and they have one of each. So they're just gonna have to buy three collars. But, you know what? I'm pretty sure they can buy them on the computer as well. I think it's more fun to have them go to the shops, but I think they can buy them on the computer. <clears throat> on the hacked computer. Okay, so let's go back out to the neighborhood now. They can definitely afford three collars. If I would have realized that um, I had to buy a different one for each pet, I would have bought, bought more while we were there. But we can do that next time. Okay, I saved the game for you, little Libby Lou. And now we are headed way down here to the Nowhere Motel. Uh, thank you so much for the raid, uh, Simplay Lorraine. I really appreciate that. Hello, everybody, and welcome. We're just getting started uh, with some new with a new household, so this is a perfect time to join. So we are going to be playing the Grunt family here, or the Beaker family. I'm sorry, it's the Beaker family, but it's uh, Aaron. Mitchie, Odette, they're, uh, they're a little baby. What's the little baby's name? Oh my god, I, f I don't even know what the baby's name is. Um, because I, di I don't have it in my spreadsheet here. And Tank, but Tank is in jail right now. So w for the first three days, Tank is in jail. So we're just going to be playing Aaron and the children and the cat. He's in jail right now. We've already played his jail round, but this is the same time period that he's in jail that we're going to be playing his family for the first three days. <clears throat> no, the baby is Ella. Ella. Let me put that in the spreadsheet right now. Ella Grunt. What a name, Ella Grunt. Uh, one second here. All right, perfect. And so this is the household, y'all. This is rough. They all live in this teeny tiny little efficiency apartment. And they only have 1,100 simoleons. I do not think that they have any money in savings either. Let me check. No. Let's check. Oh, no, 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 no. She doesn't. Tank might have some money, but she doesn't. They are super poor. They all live in this tiny little apartment. They have, we have two children here. 
Uh, Michi and Odette, let's see. She's going to become a teenager in six days. Become a teenager in six days. So they're twins. And then they just had a new baby. So this is rough. This is really rough. Um, they're super poor. So right now, um, let's put the baby in the crib. And the, yeah, the father is in prison right now. He'll he'll be out in three days. He's in jail. And they have General Fuzz the cat. Yes. Okay, you need to use the bathroom. Even though your kid's in there, you can't go in. Okay, fine. Um, go. No, don't don't stomp roaches. Don't stomp roaches in the Roach Motel where you live with all your many children. Um, instead, let's serve breakfast let's have let's make some cereal for the kids they have to get ready for school this morning and they both need to take a bath and get some breakfast i don't know if we know anything about their hobbies so let's take a look at their personalities really quick so uh mitchy is very very active and playful and odette is incredibly neat she's a neat freak and she's super active and super nice. But she's not playful at all. She's max serious. Okay, so they're very kind of different personalities. And I just want to check. Okay, also Odette's hobby is science. She's super serious and into science. And uh, Mitchy, Mitchy's hobby is sports. So that suits her very well, actually. <laughs> Humor is an alien concept to her. Yes, it is. <laughs> You're here, you're here. <laughs> hello, hello. <laughs> Thank you so much, guys. All right, so I'm just trying to take care of the kids this morning, get them ready for school. Um, Arid is going to have a hard time here by herself taking care of all the girls while Tank is in jail. Okay, and she's not getting any of his money. She's not getting any of his salary while he's in jail either. <clears throat> or she gets one day. He did have one day of vacation, so she's going to get one day. Um, she is a hostess at a restaurant. <clears throat> I'm so sorry, y'all, my voice. Um, she is a hostess at a restaurant. She only earns 125 simoleons a day. She does have to go to work today at 10 a.m. Oh, it's, never mind, the kids aren't going to school. It's Saturday. Okay, so she's going to have to call uh, a nanny, which they can barely afford, but she's got to have a babysitter so she can go to work. So, let's see. Um, where the heck is the phone in here? Where's the phone? Am I losing my mind? Why did I do that? Do they not have a phone? Did I not put a phone in here? Oh my god, do I have to buy a phone for them? Does she have a cell phone by any chance? No. Okay, well we're gonna have to spend some money on a phone. Um, we'll just get the cheapest one. Can we put, do we have a surface to put it on? No, we do not. Okay, never mind. We gotta buy the wall phone. We're gonna buy the wall phone. Put it right here. And you are gonna have to call for a nanny while Tank is gone. You gotta, you have got to have a babysitter. Let's see. Um, nanny. Yeah, they had a third kid. They have little baby Ella. Um, track her schedule and then, for now at least. Um, does she have vacation days? Oh, she has seven vacation days! Good point! Hold on. Can we, can we dismiss the nanny before she comes? Hold on. Yeah, table phones are for rich sims. Yes, cancel schedule. Never mind. She's gonna use her vacation days. <laughs> so she's gonna call hold on hold on uh, call work oh not emergency dang it call work yes she can get paid and stay home and take care of the girls no not quit job what does she do just not go and you get vacation pay I thought you had to call in I guess not Okay, she's going to stay home. Um, She's just going to cancel the carpool. Okay, so she needs to go to the bathroom right now. She's got to stay here and take care of the kids. I wish, I feel like they should call in to use their vacation days. I feel like that would be more, I don't know. 
<laughs> yeah, I wish I could use my vacation days like that to just not go. Just, I'm just not going to work today. <laughs> Um, okay, so, you just need to have fun and hygiene. You go ahead and take a bath. Let's check in on the girls. Oh my god, never mind. You do not take a bath. The kid needs to take a bath more. Um, you go take a bath. You're okay, kid. Whatever you want to do. You want to go stomp some roaches? That's fine. That's fine by me. Let's put away these leftover, the leftover cereal. And let's see, what does she want to do? So she is a popularity sim. She wants to play with and have pillow fights. So I guess she can play with her kids and she can juggle. Or she can't juggle actually. But she can play with her kids. Where did um, Odette go? She's out here stomping the roaches. Okay, we need to take care of this. She needs to pick this up and clean this up. Because we're, get we're getting we're giving roaches to the whole apartment complex. Oh, she has pleasure secondary? Oh, I don't like that. Yep, I do not like that. We are going to use the Renew You Senso Orb if we can find a place for it. Okay, here's what we're going to do. We are going to fold up the couch bed because the kids sleep on the couch bed. They all sleep in one room. Fold up the couch bed so we can put the Renew You Senso Orb in here. Get off, General Fuzz. Get off. We have, like, no room for anything left in here. And then... Oops. Let's go back and get that. Okay, we still cannot place it there. So what we will have to do... Is put the couch... In her inventory for a moment. And, oops. And then get it. Put it here. She will go use it. Reset lifetime aspiration benefits. There's more roaches out there! Um, Odette cannot stand it because she's super clean. She's like, I've got to get rid of this. It's disgusting. Where are they? I don't even see them. <laughs> yep, the kids are sleeping on a fold-out couch bed. Yes, they are. It's really sad. Oh, I'm going to hydrate for you, Kira, if I haven't already. Nope, you are not going to work. Never mind, you are not going to work. Cancel, cancel, cancel! And let's put this in your in back in your inventory and get the couch back out. Okay. No. Ugh. I'm trying to move the couch. Okay, no. It needs to stay right there. Perfect. And then let's go set her aspiration benefit points now. So, I'm going to give her the popularity tree and then we're going to give her these. So, that's helpful. And she is not going to work. She does need to have fun. She wants to swim for fun, so that's fine. She also wants to talk to Crystal and be friends with Crystal. So if we see Crystal about, you can do that. But go go swim. Go take a swim. I, I love that the car pulls outside and she's just like, nah, never mind. I'm going to go swim in the pool. See you later. <laughs> yes, you can call the landlord to spray for roaches. Yes, you can. Yeah, that's true. But I don't care if Odette wants to go stomp on them. That's fine. Um, okay, let's check in on Mitchie. She took a bath. She's super hungry and tired as well. Okay, take a nap. Take a nap. Go ahead and take a nap. Why are you so tired at 920 in the morning? Okay. Okay, that is weird. Why is the landlord swinging my child around? Really weird. She wants to play catch, go roller skating, jump rope, and catch butterflies. I think I would rather have her catch butterflies since she's like into science and stuff, but... We probably need to roll for her. Um, we need to roll for their secondary hobbies. <clears throat> Alright. Let's see. She jumped on a bed, on the bed and got super tired. Yeah. Alright, kid. Come upstairs. Also gotta, ca also gotta take care of the other baby. Come on. She didn't like him. She's like, you're creepy, dude. Leave me alone. What's up with this creepy dude talking to the kid? Y'all are jailing everyone. No, I'm not jailing him for just talking to the kid. Come on. <laughs> She's gonna go to the bathroom. She wants to do something for fun. I guess she can jump rope. She wants to jump rope, and there's really nothing else for her to do. So, um, go jump rope after you get out off the turlet. And then this kid is taking a nap. And uh, Aaron is taking a swim for fun. But it's, it's slowly 
filling up her fun. She wants to invite someone over. Maybe she can invite Crystal over and Crystal can, like, help her out with the girls because she wants to talk to Crystal and be friends with her. So, actually, I'm going to have her get out and go invite Crystal over. Um, who is that? Oh, Kana Thomason. And then she can, they can, she can have fun with her. So, call a sim. Oh, Dad's going to go out and jump rope. <laughs> Are you bringing the paper in, kid? She's so serious. She's going to read. Are you going to read the newspaper, Odette? Oh, my gosh. This kid's reading the newspaper. Um, don't swim. Come in. Come in and call your friend, Crystal. Are they friends? Let me see. She's got three bolts with Cooper. Um, she did have a crush on Johnny, too. But she ended up marrying Tank. Are they married? I don't even think they're married. Um, let's see. Crystal. Invite over. Let's see how that goes. Ooh, yeah. They they don't... Oh, she wants to be... She wants to call Crystal and talk to her, but they barely know each other. Um, we'll call and talk to her on the phone. Look, she, she and Chloe hate each other. They are mortal enemies. Alright, call Crystal and just talk to her on the phone, I guess. Sorry, dog's barking over there. I just see what he needed. Oh, I got another hydrate. Let me hydrate for sunflowers in the sky. <laughs> uh, Tank will go home in th after three days have passed. So he'll be here for the last day. Yeah. Yes, Chloe's the one still in the weird house, yes. How do you get your Sims game to look this good? Um, I have videos and guides on my website at PleasantSims.com. If you want to uh, check those out with lots of resources and instructions on how to do it. <laughs> Alright, well at least she's talking on the phone to Crystal. Oh my gosh, hold on y'all. Sorry, I just heard from my sister and I have to let... Uh, one second. That sucks. She's not coming today. Um, you want to make a custom memory for Cindy for going to jail and getting out of jail? I would love that. <laughs> and I'm just trying to... Ki Let me just check on everybody again, okay? She's doing okay on the phone. Where... Oh, this kid's still asleep. I'm going to wake her up because I don't want her to sleep all day. Uh, my personal game's going good. I'm still on the first round, honestly. <laughs> I haven't even made it through the first, past the first round. Because I haven't been playing the last couple days. Because I've been really busy with life stuff. Um, you want to do your homework? Alright, go do it. Cool. Um, gain a skill point. Oh, that's nice. She wants to gain a skill point. So, she has two logic, one charisma. I guess she could gain a body skill point. She also wants to do her homework. So, let's have her do her homework. I am going to lock in gain a skill point, though, because as many skill points as they can get as, as possible before they go to college will be very helpful. Uh, Alright, now who's next? The baby's still okay, I guess. The baby hasn't needed anything. How's General Fuzz doing? Oh, nope, now the baby needs something. General Fuzz is doing fine. Alright, she's got to get off the phone with her friends. And she's got to take care of this babby who needs a diaper change. Whew, man. This is just... This is rough. Um, where do I find my custom foods? I found most of them on either Tumblr or Mod The Sims. But I have a Pinterest. If you go to my Pinterest, Pleasant Sims, um, I have a food board. And it has, like, link... It has link to all my the custom foods that I use. Okay, um, let's feed the baby. So let's get bottle. Feed bottle to Ella. <laughs> Best friends just from changing her diaper. Yep. <laughs> I've never tried to make a custom memory. I don't know how hard that would be. I don't know. Okay, cuddle the baby. 
and then put her in the crib, clean up this dirty diaper. Her whole life is just children now. Dispose of the bottle. What is this on the floor over here? Oh, 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 is that a cat toy? Oh, that's a cat toy. <laughs> they became best friends. I love it. Aww. Best friends with the baby. <laughs> That's funny to me for some reason. She misses Tank. She wants to flirt with him and give him a back rub and dance with him. She's like, oh my god, I wish Tank was here to help me right now. This is rough. And after she finishes that, she needs to go take a bath. She's trying to get the house cleaned up. This kid is hungry and needs fun. Oh my god, come get some leftover food. Alright. She, she needs to cook lunch for them, but she's got to take a bath. No, Tank did not lose his job. Okay, they've got sandwiches in the fridge. Go ahead and have a sandwich for lunch, Michi. And then we have got to get her some fun. She'll have to go outside and jump rope, I guess. No, he did not lose his job, thankfully. He was able to keep it, even though he was in jail for three days. I know, this household is messy. But they all live in basically one room together. And let's check in on, on Odette. She is also going to probably quit doing her homework soon. Oh, she finished her homework. Alright, come have lunch. Come have lunch. Stop yelling. I know you need fun. Come have lunch and then you guys can go out and um, jump rope together. Tank's crime was fighting. Assault, I guess, is what you could call it. <laughs> Those sandwiches have been in there for two years. Okay, she got a vacation day. So she's going to take vacation days until Monday. She's going to take another vacation day tomorrow to watch the girls. And then Monday she'll go back to work. Or Monday and Tuesday she's off anyway. So that's perfect. She's not going to go to work at all this entire round. So there's no chance of a promotion for her. Um, she needs three logic skill to get a promotion anyway. And she has no desire to work on that. Okay, kid, I hear you. I hear you. Um, go outside and jump rope. Get some fun. And you do... You. She's exhausted now, but she needs fun. I'm gonna have her go jump rope as, as well. Go outside and jump rope! I told you to go jump rope, kid. She won't even jump rope. Okay, okay, okay. We'll watch cartoons. We'll watch cartoons. Fold this up so we can get to the TV. Fold this up. And then... What's wrong with the TV? Why can't we watch the TV? Is it broken? Oh my god, don't tell me that. Oh no! Okay, well, Aaron's gonna have to try to fix the TV. They ha they're just- the kids are just dying. They need fun. Here, go jump on the bed. Jump on the bed. You can't even do that. I don't know what to tell you. Oh yeah, call the landlord. Good, good point. Good point. Do not go out to the vending machine. Call the landlord to come fix the TV immediately. Call landlord request repair. I think it's weird that the landlord will come fix your TV, but I guess this is a furnished apartment when they rented it, so that makes sense. They don't really own the furniture in here. <clears throat> they do own the pull-out couch and the crib and the toys and stuff, but they don't own the TV and the bed. They own the dresser, too. Okay, so he's going to come and... Maybe they can play. They should just play with each other. Or, or, is that what they're doing? Yeah, they're going to toss the football around. Okay, great. Hello, Nate. Alright, so the girls can go swimming. Yes, they can also go swimming. Good point. I forgot about the giant pool that was just right outside here. But I think they're going to go play ball outside in the rain. When I was a little kid, I used to, me and my sister used to love to go play in the rain. Which... I don't know if that's safe or not, but we used to always do that. We, like, put... In the summer, we would, like, put on our bathing suits and go play in the rain. The pull-out couch is a mod. Um, I'm pretty sure I got it on Mod The Sims. Okay, so they're gonna play ball together. That's fine. The landlord is up here fixing the, uh... No, what are you doing, Erin? She eating some burnt... Something. I don't know what she just made. Burnt super so what is that oatmeal i don't know she burnt something you, you kids would sit in the side of the road with all the dirty rain water i know <laughs> you hated living in furnished apartments when you were in college i've i've lived in one furnished apartment and the furniture furniture was not good but at that time in my life i was happy to have a couch and a bed <laughs> 
Oh, I think it was ramen. I think you're right, Sarah. I think that was burnt ramen. It wasn't burnt cereal. Oh, I gotta hydrate. I will hydrate for you, Art Deco. Okay, kids. Jeez, I think the TV is fixed. Come on, let's come watch cartoons. Um, watch. And also watch. Come on. That'll get their fun up really fast. No, this weird, creepy landlord's still trying to talk to my kids. No. Okay, Odette. Um, come watch. Why are y'all not watching TV? Come on! Sorry, y'all. I got family stuff going on, so I'm trying to take care of it. Uh, okay. <clears throat> All right, get up here and watch cartoons. Oh my God, kids. Cha change to kids tube, kids tube. Oh. All right, and now back to Erin. Let's see if we can find any time for her. She needs fun so bad. What can she do for fun? I don't want her to play with the kids. I guess the kids, she could play red hands with one of the kids maybe. Um. Play red hands with one of the kids. Get both of your phone up. Come on. Get up, Odette. Play red hands. But Odette doesn't like to play that much, so I don't know. Uh, thank you so much, Flaming Arrow 1999 for the six-month uh, tier one sub. I really appreciate that. Thank you. Did I have The Sims 2 from EA App Origin? Um, I have it from through the EA App. I got it when it was free. Before that, I had it on disc. Okay, that did not get their fun up very much. Or enough, anyway. Um, why don't you continue watching cartoons and you try to play Red Hands with this kid. But if I didn't have it through an EA, I would go get it from old games download, honestly. But I do have it through the EA app, so I'm glad. Just m watching this mom with kids is exhausting. I know, it really is. <laughs> Okay, what are you trying to do, kid? Walk away, walk away, walk away, walk away, walk Stop walking away. What is happening? Ah, oh, they can barely move in this tiny apartment. My God. All right, what are you trying to do? Unfold? Don't, what, don't unfold. Oh, she's exhausted. Just sleep here. Sleep here. Sleep there. Oh, jeez. We got bills to pay. Okay, you got, come out and pay the bills. And then we got to get some food for these kids. Um, wait, where's the mailbox? Oh, there it is. Get mail. Oh, no, she's taking care of the baby. Oh, my God. Oh, the baby's aging up. What the crap? I didn't realize the baby was going to age up. Oh, my God. Now we've got a toddler. Okay, we got a little toddler here. She looks like her dad. Oh, my gosh. Come back. She looks like her dad. This is little Ella Grunt. Doesn't she look like Tank, y'all? Oh my gosh. And let's check out her... Oh my gosh, she needs to go to the bathroom. Let's check out her personality as well. She is neat. And she's kind of neat, kind of playful. She is a Taurus. And she's very... She's not very nice. She's very grouchy. She's very grouchy. Oh my goodness. Look at her little face. Hold on. Let's get her turned around. Let's wait till she gets on the ground here. We can see her better. I think she looks like her dad, though. Uh, let me see. Let's get down here so we can see her. She's mean. Wow. <laughs> okay. Hello, child. Come on. She's gonna go play. All right, I'm having such a hard time just trying to keep everybody's needs met here. Whew. She's a grunt, all right. Yep, she's a grunt. That is a cute outfit. Okay, so I'm just about to go through everybody and see what I can do to take care of everyone. You need to go to the bathroom. Oh my god, the litter box needs to be clean. But we also need to serve dinner. <sighs> all right, let's make many single plates of pizza for the kids. You are exhausted. Okay, all right, all right. This is, oh my God. Can we not turn off the TV? Okay, it's off. You go to sleep. I guess they're not going to eat the pizza, so never mind. Don't make many plates. Um, just go to sleep, kids. Shoo the, shoo the pet away and go to sleep. 
Oh, Lord. They don't even have a stove. All they have is a microwave and a mini fridge. Yep. Oh, thank you so much, Soupy Shan, for raiding. Hello and welcome, everybody. We've got chaos here with Erin Beaker trying to take care of her kids. Okay, you know what? Clean this out. Clean this out. All right, I guess the kids are going to sleep there. I don't know. They won't go to sleep for some reason. Ugh. I know. Tank has more uh, space in jail than this family has. All right, she's going to sleep there. That's fine. Kids sleep there. Erin can sleep on the pull-out couch. Jeez. Hello, Soupy Shan. Ugh. Oh my god, what why are you waking up now? Why are you waking up now? I don't let's see. Um I don't why can't I do smart beds? I don't know. I don't know how I'm not able to clear it. You have to do it through How do I do it? I don't remember. No, the TV's not on. Um, let's have- Okay, Mitchie, just come over here and sleep here. Oh my god, go to bed! Oh, two separate pull-out couches. Yeah, that's a good idea. We get two chairs. I don't know if they can afford that. Hold on. I I'm pretty sure I have a pull-out... Do I have a pull-out chair couch? I don't- I don't know if I have that. I know there is one. Is this it? No. No. I don't think I have it. I don't think I have the chair one. Do you see it? Or maybe it's under beds. Under beds? Oh, it's under beds! How much is it? Oof. Why can't I delete that? Is it because it's not folded up? Hold on. Failed to place bed under chair? I'm just- hold on! I know, just hold on. Okay. Right. Let's buy two of these. And that should work. Okay, so Mitchie, oh, unfold. You get out of the way. You get out of the way. Go, go make some pizza. Uh, you go have some pizza for dinner. You sleep here, and then you. Okay, she's sleeping there. I'm not gonna wake her up. Mitchie, go sleep. Why is she? Okay, what is that? What is that? What is that? Go here. Sleep. Sleep, I tell you. Whew. Why, why won't she sleep? What is the deal? Does anybody know what's going on? Why is it doing that? Um, I can't. How do I clear smart beds? Because I'm not. I can't find it. Oh, bed ownership. Oh, 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 oh. Clear all. Okay. Sleep. It was- I- I went to that menu like three times and didn't even see it. Okay, finally! Jeez! My god! So stressful! Alright, uh, so let's go back to Erin. She's eating her dinner and then let's check on the toddler. Okay, the toddler, we need to go take her to the potty like immediately, but she's too tired so she's probably not gonna go. No, okay, so let's put her in the crib. She did not really go to the bathroom. But put her in the crib. She's too tired. Oh my god. Put her in the crib. What are you doing? You can eat your pizza in a minute. Put her in the crib. Alright. I don't know. The kid. She fell asleep. She fell asleep. Just here. Wake up. Oh. This is so stressful. No. Don't turn on the TV. Why would you turn on the TV? You woke up all the children. Oh, I'm gonna have to just put the TV in her inventory at night so she doesn't do that. Why would you do that, Erin? Why would you just wake up all the- I just got the kids to bed. I just got the kids to bed. 
But you know what? At least we can put Odette over here now. Oh my god. No, don't make the beds. It's 1030. Oh my god. Please, everybody go to sleep. No! She's turned it on again. She's turned it on again. What in the hell is wrong with this? Oh! Okay. You know what we're gonna do? Turn it off. Turn it off. We're gonna have to put up the TV. We're gonna have to put up the TV at night. In your inventory, because that... Aaron, I don't even know what to say to you. Why on earth would you do that? Okay, we're putting up the TV. Oh. <sighs> Odette, I'm about to clear your bed thingy. Sleep here. Come sleep in your bed. You sleep here. Okay, you please go to sleep, Ella. And you, Aaron, you need to go to sleep too. Oh my god. Everybody go to sleep, please. <sighs> Finally. Oh no, the kid got out of the... Why are you out of the... Oh no. Get up. Get up. Put the kid back in the crib. The kid's gonna eat dog food. Great. Cat food. Great. Eating cat food. All right. All right. That's, that's great. Kids eating cat food. Perfect. Go to sleep. Oh my god. Ugh. All right. Finally. I'm just gonna have to put the TV up at night. There's no other choice. <laughs> this is chaos. Single parent hell. Yes. <laughs> I know she, she probably does wish she was in jail with Tank at this point. Jeez. Jeez. Alright, I'm saving. I'm saving here. Oh, I can't wait until Tank gets out of jail, so at least he can help some. Um, I do not think I have a one-tile crib. No, I do not. He's gonna get an earful when he gets home. How dare you go to jail and leave me here with all these kids? <laughs> you can't imagine it'd take three hours to get three children to bed in such a tiny apartment. Yeah, I mean, it does make sense. <laughs> yes, all the apartments are the same size here. And the only other apartments we have are the flop house, which are... Oh my god, why did Mitchie just reset? Sleep, please, child. Which are even smaller, is what I was trying to say. Now, the kid, cra the baby crapped her pants, so now it, hopefully she'll sleep th for a little bit longer, though, before she starts crying and wakes everybody up again. I know, Tank being back does mean one more sim to share in our tiny space, but also he can earn money so we can try to save up and move. And also, he can help, like, take care of the baby and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Aaron calling jail. Tank, you get your punk ass back here. It's hell in here. That's why, remember when we were playing jail and on his last day, she showed up there right when it was time for him to get out. She was like, I'm ready. Come home right now. She was there ready to pick him up. <laughs> I know the cat sleeping on the bed. Aw, the cat was thinking about a collar. We need to get a collar for this cat too. All right, let's speed things up until the morning. So we can put ourselves through some more hell. Okay, the Ella just woke everybody up at 3.45 in the morning. Alright, we need to change her diaper and you girls can go back to sleep. You cannot go back to sleep. Okay, great. Great, you're wide awake at 3.45. Perfect. Perfect! Um, you need to go to the bathroom more, so you do that. You go get some leftover cereal. She pulled him out of jail by the ear, yeah. <laughs> Oh, yeah, he probably didn't get that much rest in years. I bet you're right, Marius. Okay, what else does this kid need? Um, let's go ahead and feed her. Get her another bottle, I guess. Get everybody breakfast at 4 a.m. Why not? Uh, Mitchie, you can, can come get um, leftover. No, don't go to the vending machine. We got cereal in here. You can't have vending machine food for breakfast, kid. What's wrong with you? All right, um, you, what do you need to do? You also need to eat. What are you doing? Brushing your teeth? No, come eat. Come eat. I mean, it doesn't even make any sense. The cat was just running around on a dirty diaper. We got to fill up the, fill the cat bowl first and then you can eat. 
Whew, my god, y'all. This is stressful. Uh, no, okay, get out of the way. Get out of the way, kid. Go play with this. Go play with this. Uh, it's, you know, it's really the lack of space that causes so many problems. All right, you can go to the bathroom, take a bubble bath. I know you need fun. There's a dog trying to jump in my lap. Come here, pumpkin. Hold on. Come here. Come on. Come on. Get up here. Come on. You can do it. Get up. Get up. Get up. There's a dog trying to jump in my lap, but he doesn't know if he can make it. Come on. Come on. Come here. I'll pick you up. Come here. I'll pick you up. Come here. He's just running around trying to jump in my lap. Look! Look! Look at this! Is that not the cutest little puffer you've ever seen? Aww. <laughs> Aww, come here. He was trying to get in my lap. Uh-uh. <laughs> it's my boyfriend's dog. <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's my boyfriend's dog. He's over here visiting us today. Okay, what's happening with my sims? I was just totally neglected them for the pupper. Um, what is she trying to do? Play with? She's playing with from way over there. Okay, cool. You're all- Both of them are playing with the toddler. That's kind of cute, actually. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh. Getting down? Okay. Odette, you need fun. All right, can you play too? Can we all play? Can we all just sit down and play together? That's so cute. Nope, she apparently is... Okay, everybody's reset now for some reason. All right, whatever. Um, I guess we can get the TV out again. <coughs> so let's fold these up. <coughs> Sorry, I keep coughing, y'all. Um, fold these up. Let me get the TV out. It's Sunday, so the kids are not going... Oops, why did I do that? The kids are not going to school again today. I think when they go to school, that's going to make things easier as well. <laughs> she can do the newspaper crossword. Can the kids do it? I don't know if kids can do it. Where is our newspaper? Let's see. Um, nope. She can read it and make an airplane. All right. We've got to take care of this crap. Fold these up. Watch cartoons, y'all. All right, you just fold this one up, too, then. Because Odette is just refusing to cooperate. You fold this one up, too. And then watch cartoons, please. And I wonder if she doesn't watch cartoons because she's... Is it because she's not playful or something? Because I tried to get her earlier to do it, and she wouldn't do it. Watch cartoons! Watch! What is wrong with you children who don't want to watch cartoons? Okay, is it on kids' channel? Change to kids tube. And now watch. Did it go off? What is happening with the T? Oh my god. Okay. Hold on. You, you know what then? You're just going to play red hands with each other. I don't know what to tell you anymore. Play red hands. Can you even play red hands? Play cops and robbers. I don't care. Play something. Oh. She's too serious. She probably wants to watch the news. It didn't break. She just kept turning it on and off. Okay, they're playing cops and robbers. That's fine. And then let's check in on the baby. She needs to be potty trained, which now we're not going to be able to do. She's over here playing with a cat. Let's try to potty train the baby. Watch out, kids. I knew this was going to happen. They're playing cops and robbers in the bathroom. Great. Okay, hold on. We're going to move the potty out. I'm going to move the potty into the kitchen. Potty train the baby in the kitchen. Okay, perfect. Perfect! And then we've got to fill up the cat bowl. Oh, wow. This has been... This has been more difficult than I actually expected it to be when I first started playing this family. She wants to go visit Trista. She's like, I gotta get out of here. You can't leave the kids. And you're not going to work today either. Um... Let's check on the baby again. All right, she's okay besides hygiene. We'll bathe Ella. Let's get the girls out of the bathroom. 
Okay, her fun is filled up. Her fun is not filled up, but at least she's not dying now. Let's have her watch TV. Hopefully she can watch TV. Now let's see if she turns it off again. She's watching sports. Change to kids tube. Okay, she's actually watching cartoons now. That's good. And let's see. This kid is hungry. Go eat some more cereal, I guess. Oh my god. More difficult than Tiny Leaf? No, I don't think it is. Erin's going crazy. She is. She's losing her mind. Gotta bathe the baby now. Oh, she's gonna bathe herself. Okay, never mind. She was like, screw that. I need a bath. I need to relax. I don't care. Let the baby be dirty. <laughs> Oh, wow. Ugh. It is stressful. We're going to get through it, though. No, you are not going to work. You are not going to work. No, no, no. You're taking vacation day. You've got plenty of vacation days. I'm glad she saved up all those vacation days for when Tank went to jail. Okay, bathe your child. Bathe your child now. Um, Odette's watching, still watching TV. Where is Mitchie? Oh, you're out here at the vending machine, kid! And here comes creepy landlord trying to talk to her, trying to swing around the children. Okay, this is weird. It's getting weird. Yeah, she's like, please let me go to work. I need to talk to some adults. I know. Uh, Tank gets home, and he still has another two days. Or day and a half, really. Okay, reset, Mitchie. Good, because that was creepy. Um, she needs to come inside and get some cereal. What is this kid watching on TV? What are you even watching, kid? Oh, well, you're having fun, so I don't care. Watch whatever you want. She does want to get a skill point and jump rope, so I think I'm going to stop her and have her go jump rope. Whew. And this kid's going to get some... Is it lunchtime? It's 10 o'clock. I'll go ahead and let her have a sandwich. And then the baby needs to be put down. And then you, Aaron, need to take care of yourself. Oh my god. I thought you just took a bath. Take another one, I guess. Did the baby spit up on you or something? Oh my god, we pa I thought we paid the bills. Aw, oh, crap. She didn't even pay the bills. Oh, get mail. Oh my goodness, y'all. The collection agency's calling. She's got a... An efficiency apartment full of children. Her husband's in jail. She has no money. She can't even go to work. This is horrible. <laughs> oh, okay. Take a bath and then go pay. Then go pay the bills. That's fine. That is fine. What are you doing, kid? Making the bed? Of course you are. Uh, go. Okay. Go outside. I thought she would go outside if I told her to jump rope, but apparently not. So I'm gonna make you go outside and then tell you to jump rope. And you, um, I don't know. I don't know what, you do whatever you want. I don't care. Do whatever you would like. There's another child you could play with out there. Um, that's a good idea. They can go to a park. Um, but I don't think we have time to do it now because the stream's going to be over soon. But next time when we come back next week, we'll take them to the park. That's a great idea. Or the swim- the public pool or something. I don't know. We'll take them somewhere. Um, let's see. You need food. So, oh, go pay the bills. Then we are gonna serve some, uh, sandwiches. Lunch meat sandwiches. And then you're gonna clean this turlet. Oh, not use it. Clean it. Okay, you work, woke the baby up because you're watching TV. You need to be outside. Okay, you want to take a bath? Fine. Whatever. I don't care. Just do something. Besides scream. <laughs> Strange Town does not have a park, but they have other lots. Maybe we could build a park. No, we don't have enough money to build a park. Oh. They have a, pu they have a uh, public pool we could go to, I guess. Even though they have a pool outside. Alright, make lunch and then you need to pay these bills. You got the red notice. Pay all bills. Wait. Clean. Oh, yeah. Clean the toilet. Make sandwiches. Clean the toilet. Pay the bills. <laughs> Odette gained a skill point. So, she's happy now. 
Um, I'm going to let her jump rope until lunch. Okay, lunch is ready. So let's get her in here to eat lunch. Have yourself a bologna sandwich, child. And you too, kid. Get in here and eat. Everybody eat. The baby is still doing okay. So we have a, like a moment of calm for a second. <laughs> let's hope for a hole so they can dig for treasure. Right. <laughs> Oh, yeah, the, the apartment life trailer park would be great in Strange Town. Yeah, that's a good point. I might build a trailer park just for Strange Town. Um, is it, it's not Monday yet, so taxes are not due yet. They'll be due tomorrow. So she can get another day of pay before taxes are due. Okay, everything's calm for a moment, y'all. Oh, my God. They do need the magic lamp. <laughs> Oh, save game. Thank you. I will save game. Whew. No, I don't think I ever shared this apartment lot on my website. Did I? I don't know. Did, does it, I don't remember if I did or not. <laughs> some lots I've shared, some lots I haven't. Did I save this? Oh, I did. Then yes, it is on my... <laughs> then yes, it is on my website. This chaos gives you heart palpitations. Where did she go? Oh, she's still... Did she pay the bill? Why did she pay the... Where did she go? Would she go put a plate out here? What the hell was... What was that about? Um, I will... I think... Oh, no, I... I, uh... Yeah, you... Wait, hold on. Yeah, you did. This is Slappy's, right? No, this is not. This is not Slappy's flop house. This is just a motel that I built. Um, so my Sims could have, like, little small apartments to live in. This is just a motel. Hey, that's messed up. Hold on. I gotta fix it. I'll give them their money back. Hold on. Can I fix it? No, uh... I don't, uh... Hold on. I can't put- it won't let me put it there! I have move objects on! Alright, it won't let me put it there anyway, oh well. The laptop's still there, nobody's stolen it. The community laptop that just sits outside in the rain. Oh, cause it's public space, right, right, right. That's why I can't edit it. That makes sense. Of course, jeez. Sometimes I forget they're in an apartment. Uh, oh, I gotta hydrate. Um, I was hoping with move objects it would still let me do it, but it didn't let me do it. Alright, so uh, she is exhausted at 2.30 in the afternoon. She needs a nap already. Who's this kid talking to? Oh, that's Floyd. She was, she's wanting to play red hands. The baby's okay for the moment. Actually, we need to potty train her. Um, potty train Ella. And actually, I'm going to put the potty back in the bathroom. And let's potty train Ella. Yeah, I'm not going to worry about it. I'm not going to worry about um, editing it. It doesn't bother me that much. I was just going to do it real quick, but... Since I can't, it's fine. Um, alright. Potty train the baby. Potty train the baby. Oh, we used a vacation day. Alright, they've got 963 simoleons, which is not great. Oh, we need to put these leftovers away, too, before they go bad. We can't afford to waste any food in this house. Trying to potty train the baby. And then she is so tired, she is going to have to take a nap. She's gonna have to. Alright. Hopefully the kids don't keep her awake. I'm surprised she's not waking up. She's super tired. This kid is also exhausted. So let's shoo past. It's because they woke up at 3.45 in the morning. They're all super tired. So everybody's gonna go to bed. Oh, wait, somebody needs to put the baby to bed. Okay, get up. Put Ella in the crib. No, she's hungry. Okay, feed her. Oh my god. Get bottle for Ella. You gotta get up. You don't have time to sleep. Oh my god, the phone's gonna wake everybody up. Oh, go back to sleep, kids. It sucks that they don't have a separate room because everything wakes them up. Oh my god, sleep, sleep, sleep. 
Why didn't you drink your bottle? Where does your bottle even go? Did she even get you a bottle? Oh yeah, she did. Drink your bottle. Put the phone in the bathroom. That's not a bad idea. <sighs> they do need to move into the trailer park. I agree. I might build a trailer park. This is, I don't know if this is more stressful than Test of Time, but it's close. It's close. She's talking to Lola. Um, but you need to hang up because you got to put this kid in, in bed and go to sleep yourself. Everybody just go to sleep. That's great. I don't even know how the cat's doing. We have had no time for this. Somehow the cat's doing great. The cat's thriving in the chaos. <laughs> Yeah, I will put the phone in the kitchen. That's a good point. I will put it in the kitchen. Hopefully that counts as a separate room. Did I put down a thing? I didn't. Dang it. I didn't even think about that. I wasn't planning on this type of family living in these apartments, but this is just where this family ended up. It was the only thing they could afford. <laughs> General Fuzz is doing great. All right, get to bed. Whew. Oh my gosh, y'all. All right. I put the baby in the kitchen, yeah. Um, I'm going to save here. Oh my goodness. I'm going to save here and I'm going to wrap up the stream here. And then so when we come back next week, we still have two more days with this family. And like this, once this day is over, we'll have two more days. And then Tank will be coming back on the last day, which is probably going to bring more chaos. I don't know if it's going to be better or worse, honestly. I don't know. And rent's due tomorrow. Crap. Rent and taxes have to be paid tomorrow which really sucks. And then she is off for two days, so she's not going to get any money. And But when Tank gets back, we'll get a little bit of money. Oh my god, y'all. this It's just like so hard for this family. Yes, we are back to Saturday next week. This was just a one-time thing moving to Sunday. So we're back to Saturday, but I'll also be streaming tomorrow. I don't know what time exactly. I think I'm going to try and stream from like 5 to 7 p.m. Central Time. Um, but you can check, check my Twitch schedule. Um, but I will be streaming The Sims 4 tomorrow, so I hope to see you guys there. Oh yeah, let me add Trailer Park to my sticky note. Maybe someday I'll get to actually doing these things. Trailer Park. And I may just download one, I may build one, I don't know, we'll see. Maybe we'll build one on a stream. But I would like to say thank you guys so much for joining me for another another Strange Town stream. It was really fun, it was stressful, but it was fun! I'm I'm honestly ready to get through this family. And move on. Let me see who we're playing next. Oh, thank you so much, Waycate95, for the Prime sub. Um, Let's see. Next, we are going to be playing Tina and Willis, who live in the flop house. So, Tina was Rip Grunt's uh, girlfriend, or they were engaged, but he cheated on her, and she left him and took the kid. And they live in the flop house, because that's all they could afford. So, we're going to be playing them after uh, we finish this round. And then we play Gerard, and then we play The Jail, and then we start over all the way at the beginning with the Curious family again. So that's going to be fun. All right, guys, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your weekend. There's not much left of it, but I hope it's good for you, and I will see you all tomorrow. Don't burn your cereal! <laughs> Bye, guys!